It is Groovy Jazz and Rory Cleary in front, followed by Le Ball towards the near side, Declan McDonough improving Bronze Age in the centre and towards the near side is Early Call, Sagittarius Rising and Betsy Trotter trying to make ground the far side, Vinnie's Wish down the outside, racing now towards the final furlong, Groovy Jazz, Betsy Trotter on the near side, putting in a late bid is Katie Krull, and out on the near side, Vinnie's Wish, racing up towards the finish now, Vinnie's Wish on the near side, over on the far side is Katie Krull as they hit the line, just going to be Vinnie's Wish, Don O'Connor on the near side. It is Groovy Jazz and Rory Cleary in front, followed by Le Ball towards the near side, Declan McDonough improving Bronze Age in the centre and towards the near side is Early Call, Sagittarius Rising and Betsy Trotter trying to make ground the far side, Vinnie's Wish down the outside, racing now towards the final furlong, Groovy Jazz, Betsy Trotter on the near side, putting in a late bid is Katie Krull, and out on the near side, Vinnie's Wish, racing up towards the finish now, Vinnie's Wish on the near side, over on the far Far side is Katie Krull as they hit the line. Just going to be Vinnie's wish. Don O'Connor on the near side. In the far side, Katie Krull. And they're being followed in by Le Ball and Betsy Trotter. Elegant Emmeline and Rory Cleary, Harry Speed in the centre, Akalia flawlessly is right over on the far side, beginning the climb now towards the final furlong, Elegant Emmeline comes to join Hakiba, flawlessly racing isolated over on the far side, Akalia, Dunard, Prince and Aspen Bell, flawlessly over on the far side, comes now within the centre, putting in a strong bid, Dunard, Prince, Hakiba and Aspen Bell, Dunard, Prince now as they run to the line with Hakiba and Aspen Bell and Aspen Bell on the near side side of Akiba Elegant Emmeline and Rory Cleary, Harry Speed in the centre, Akalia flawlessly is right over on the far side, beginning the climb now towards the final furlong, Elegant Emmeline comes to join Hakiba, flawlessly racing isolated over on the far side, Akalia, Dunard, Prince and Aspen Bell, flawlessly over on the far side, comes now within the centre, putting in a strong bid, Dunard, Prince, Hakiba and Aspen Bell, Dunard, Prince now as they run to the line with Hakiba and Aspen Bell and Aspen Bell on the near side of Akiba, Donard Prince and flawlessly followed by Harry Speed. And they're being followed by Lone Voice as they make their way on now past the two. Still standing now from House Call towards the outside. Scorpion Black is in third, racing now to the final furlong. Still standing in House Call in front of Scorpion Black as they race inside the final 200 yards. It's the stable companions now. Still standing in Colm O'Donoghue in front of House Call and Colin Keane and running up towards the finish. It's still standing in the lead and going to score by a couple of lengths for Colm O'Donoghue who close second, house call gives Jesse a 1-2, Wichita Lion has run on well in third, then came Scorpion Black, Sereric and Queen of Bab. And they're being followed by Lone Voice as they make their way on now past the two. Still standing now from House Call towards the outside. Scorpion Black is in third, racing now to the final furlong. Still standing in House Call in front of Scorpion Black as they race inside the final 200 yards. It's the stable companions now. Still standing in Colm O'Donoghue in front of House Call and Colin Keane and running up towards the finish. It's still standing in the lead and going to score by a couple of lengths for Colm O'Donoghue who close second, house call gives Jesse a 1-2, Wichita Lion has run on well in third, then came Scorpion Black, Sereric and Queen of Bab. And in the lead is Flaming Audi from Vocal Music in second. Third on the inside is Powersville. Then comes Band of Outlaws, Sebastiano Ricci. It's my turn. And Burmese Blazer as they race on. Now with a furlong and a half to go. In the centre, Band of Outlaws comes to join Vocal Music. Flaming Audi is next with Powersville. It's my turn. And Burmese Blazer on the climb up towards the final 200 yards. And in the lead is Band of Outlaws in front. Being followed by It's My Turn. Burmese Blazer on the outside of vocal music, Flaming Audi still staying on again on the inside but Band of Outlaws and Porik Beggy will win readily by three to four lengths, Flaming Audi second, vocal music third, it's my turn is fourth. 
and in the lead is Flaming Audi from Vocal Music in second. Third on the inside is Powersville. Then comes Band of Outlaws, Sebastiano Ricci. It's my turn. And Burmese Blazer as they race on. Now with a furlong and a half to go. In the centre, Band of Outlaws comes to join Vocal Music. Flaming Audi is next with Powersville. It's my turn. And Burmese Blazer on the climb up towards the final 200 yards. And in the lead is Band of Outlaws in front. Being followed by It's My Turn. Burmese Blazer on the outside of vocal music flaming out he's still staying on again on the inside but band of outlaws and porik beggy will win readily by three to four lengths flaming out second vocal music third it's my turn is fourth They're being followed by Stoked on the outside of Rick Rack in Scribe, beginning to make ground between horses. Slaney Street, Niven is down the outside as they race now to the final furlong. Rick Rack in the centre with Inscribe coming there strongly for Colin Keane on the near side. On the rail is Maudling Magdalene. Lucky Mistake is putting in a late bid. Stoked and Niven. Inscribe is the leader now with Rick Rack and on the far side. Lucky Mistake is running on strongly, running up towards the finish. Inscribe and Lucky Mistake as they go towards the Line. Head bobber, 99 of the season for the champion jockey. They're being followed by Stoked on the outside of Rick Rack in Scribe, beginning to make ground between horses. Slaney Street, Niven is down the outside as they race now to the final furlong. Rick Rack in the center with Inscribe coming there strongly for Colin Keane on the near side. On the rail is Maudling Magdalene. Lucky Mistake is putting in a late bid. Stoked and Niven. Inscribe is the leader now with Rick Rack and on the far side. Lucky Mistake is running on strongly, running up towards the finish. Inscribe and Lucky Mistake as they go towards the line head bobber 99 of the season for the champion jockey Colin Keane lucky mistake second Rick Rack is third and Maudling Magdalene is fourth Western Boy is after them with Grand Partner, but beginning to climb now towards the final furlong and a half. And Highland Fling in the centre now, being chased by Swamp Fox in the centre. Tudor City has made ground. She's a star on the inside. And then Grand Partner racing now towards the final furlong. Swamp Fox on the far side of Highland Fling. On the outside, Western Boy and Dalton Highway coming home late. It's Swamp Fox in front of Highland Fling. Western Boy lunging late, going towards the line, Swamp Fox, Swamp Fox and Gary Carroll for Joe Murphy, Highland Fling, Western Boy and a break then to the fourth home who is Grand Partner. Western Boy is after them with Grand Partner, but beginning to climb now towards the final furlong and a half. And Highland Fling in the centre now, being chased by Swamp Fox in the centre. Tudor City has made ground. She's a star on the inside. And then Grand Partner racing now towards the final furlong. Swamp Fox on the far side of Highland Fling. On the outside, Western Boy and Dalton Highway coming home late. It's Swamp Fox in front of Highland Fling. Western Boy lunging late, going towards the line swamp fox swamp fox and gary carroll for joe murphy highland fling western boy and a break then to the fourth home who is grand partner Hornack and Colin Keane coming there towards the stand side as they race now towards the final furlong. Backstairs bounder. Warnack now coming there with Bruniel and Tail of Woe. Great Trango is putting in a run the outside inside the last 200. And it's Warnack and Colin Keane. Pat Smullen giving chase on the outside. Can he spoil the party? It's got to be the 100. Warnack and Colin Keane up towards the finish. It's 100 for the champion and beats Pat Smullen in second. I like him as third and they're followed in by Bruniel and with the 100 wins for Warnack, Oshinor also becomes the champion apprentice. Warnack and Colin Keane coming there towards the stand side as they race now towards the final furlong. Backstairs bounder. Warnack now coming there with Bruniel and Tail of Woe. Great Trango is putting in a run the outside inside the last 200. And it's Warnack and Colin Keane. Pat Smullen giving chase on the outside. Can he spoil the party? It's got to be the 100. Warnack and Colin Keane up towards the finish. 
It's 100 for the champion and beats Pat Smullen in second. I like him as third and they're followed in by Bruniel and with the 100 wins for Warnock, Oshinor also becomes the champion apprentice. They're spread across the track. Juline leads two for T on the far rail. On the near side, Lagos to Vegas, followed by Toca de Moor. Then chasing them is Mustajia and Laws of Spin. Beginning to climb now to the final furlong. Toca de Moor on the near side of Lagos to Vegas. Mustajia after them, and then Juline inside the last 200 yards. And Toca de Moor and Pat Smullen on the near side as they run up towards the finish. And the nine times champion jockey. Pat Smullen and Dermot Well have the final say. Tucker de Moore beats Lagos to Vegas. Mustajir is third. And fourth home is Juline. They're spread across the track. Juline leads two for T on the far rail. On the near side, Lagos to Vegas, followed by Toca de Moore. Then chasing them is Mustajir and Laws of Spin. Beginning to climb now to the final furlong. Toca de Moore on the near side of Lagos to Vegas. Mustajir after them, and then Juline inside the last 200 yards. And Toca de Moore and Pat Smullen on the near side as they run up towards the finish. And the nine times champion jockey. Pat Smullen and Dermot Well have the final say. Tucker Demore beats Lagos to Vegas. Mustajir is third and fourth home is Juline.